I gotta ask you, um, because this has been very, 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 very controversial. Um, Final Cut Pro 10, since you're in the Max. <laughs> I saw that coming a mile away. It's like, yeah. eh, eh, eh. Oh, what's, no, what's your uh, thoughts on I, that? I held on to uh, the previous version of Final Cut um, just because even like it seemed like Final Cut Express had more functionality than the new Final Cut 10. Um, but I know, and, and it's sad. I yeah. mean, I love all of that, but Apple seems to be taking this turn to um, kind of where they used to have like a high end, a super yeah. high end professional level of uh, hardware and software. And then, you know, kind of your base consumer level, like you had Final Cut and then you had iMovie. But now they're both kind of being where iMovie is moving up in complexity yeah. and then Final Cut is being dumbed down. And so they're just kind of throwing everything in that middle you know, common denominator genre. So you don't have the highs and lows that they used to. And both, and I, and this seems to be a trend that is both in their hardware and their software. So it, it kind of makes me sad and it kind of makes me think, you know, but I mean, how movie studios have been doing that for years. You know, if they make a comic book or superhero uh -huh. movie, they have to, you know, fancy it up with love stories or something else to kind of, you know, try and hit the biggest swath of people instead of just pleasing like the comic book nerds and staying true to the book. Well, to me, it's really two, two kind of reasons. One is it's kind of moving. I've been noticing some trends. It has been kind of moving to the prosumer level. Um, like newscasting has a little bit. And I, I did a story on, uh, I think it's CNN. They actually, you know, go on prosumer level and I think with Apple is they're trying to revolutionize video editing and they could, well, we could take years and years to go to what Final Cut Pro 10 is now and, you know, mm -hmm. just slowly do it. Or we can jump ahead and do it all at once, even though people will complain and bring them up to a, a great piece of software. I know there's a lot of missing features and all that because, you know, it can use multi-core, it can... Um, it uses a yeah. totally new, uh, I think it's called AV Foundation. It's really fast. Um, but, you know, there's pros and cons to that. Um, but I think that's the reason why they kind of wanted to get ahead of, of everybody else as far as uh, the, the video editing scene. Now, they're, they're, this month they're supposed to be coming out or the next within the next couple of months, uh, multicam editing is supposed to be added into Final Cut Pro Ten. Yeah, that was a huge feature that a lot of people were complaining that was left out. Um, but you can so, still do it, though. I mean, though. obviously, they're, they're going to have to add it in, in, in yeah. updates. It'll just be a matter of when those updates are going to drop. And you can still do it, but it's supposedly it's a little bit harder. But um, if you get a bunch of cameras that you do, you just sync the audio all together, the different cameras, because normally you set up different cameras, angles, and record at the same time, but you just, uh, to do the multicam editing, you just sync all the audio together and it will place the, you know, how many cameras you got all together and sync it where it corresponds with the the video portion and you just, you know, edit from there. But it, supposedly with multicam editing, it just makes it a whole lot easier. I don't know. I admit, um, I kind of jumped from iMovie to Final Cut Pro 10, so I haven't seen the multicam feature, so... Mm, okay, yeah. I went from like Final Cut Express to Final Cut Pro, but like I said, I haven't gone. And it it, it kind of feels like, and, and even my experience with the Final Cuts has been very limited. I'm by no means a professional and by no means putting out um, super spectacular production quality stuff. Yeah. Um, but it, yeah, it kind of feels like going from Pro to 10 would be kind of a small step backwards like 10 kind of fits in between where you know express and pro was like 10 was just kind of that middle ground like they just mushed the two together well did you try the the or try the trial version which which doesn't you know you can use it for free just to you know test it out have you actually of what 10 yeah final cut pro 10 you can get a trial version to, to test it out 
No, I haven't done anything with Final Cut. And oh, okay. I, I'm just wondering. I'm just I, wondering. I should get on that. Um, and let me see. Didn't Apple buy Final Cut Pro? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, well the it's other one, Apple's though, product. Yeah, they they started from the very beginning. Supposedly, it was the guy that did Premiere. It was one of the guys that made Premiere uh, or something like that, and they got they they employed him, and then he's the one that started um, Final Cut Pro or something like that. I mean, I yeah, um, way back when um, uh, Steve Jobs wanted Premiere on the Mac back in the early '90s when they were really trying to make a uh, run at video and photo photography um, editing, you know, and really trying to hit that uh, market. Uh, Adobe wouldn't just would not make uh, Premiere for the Mac, and so yeah. they had to go another route. But you know, I mean. I think what it was for do? the best. Final yeah. Cut is a nut, much better program today um, than I think Premiere is. Well, Final Cut Pro 7, though, right? Is yeah. that what you're yeah, saying? Yeah, Pro. I mean, 10, 10 is, you know, it's debatable. Yeah, but, yeah, debatable. Um, I admit I love it, but I, I didn't start out with Final Cut Pro 7 and, you know, knew all that. I jumped into Final Cut Pro 10. I love it because I admit I'm, I came from iMovie, so... You know, mm-hmm. I'll probably have a lot of, I've actually did a video on it and there's people thumbs down it because it was the people that coming off final, you know, the, the pro editors and they were like thumbing my down in my video. I'm like, oh, well, <laughs> you know, that's okay. <laughs> They're like, yeah, ah, it sucks. Get out of here. 